굉장히 쿵쿵 뛰면서도 찌찌 Hello, uh, K-pop time. Uh, I'm here to answer some of your questions, so let's go. Hello everyone, my name is Tavi and I'm a singer-songwriter and I just came out with my album uh, Up and Down, so check it out. It just came very naturally, you know. I'm not a very expressive person in person, and I needed an outlet for my emotions to kind of escape, and music ended up being that outlet. And basically, I just through my teenage years, I always listened to music, always sang, and that was my one method of relieving stress. And they always say, do what you love. So I follow my heart and became a singer. Basically, I went into an idol group uh, as a trainee to basically try to get myself more well known so that I can have a stable place where I can start to do real music after that. But the more I did it, the more I felt like I was kind of compromising myself, the music that I wanted to do, and it just didn't feel right. And like, I didn't feel like I was doing music and cause the genre was so different from what I'm used to. And I was dancing most of the time. <laughs> so I mean, uh, it was a big decision. I had to think a lot about it, but yeah, I mean, I thought long and hard and I just decided that it might be best if I take things into my own hands and start writing my own music. So it worked out for the better for me though. Basically life. My whole entire life inspires me and I know I'm still young, I'm still learning, but that doesn't mean that I have thoughts and things I want to express. So I mean, as long as I'm feeling something, I feel like I'll always have inspiration for music. So. I like Up and Down, probably because it's the newest song and I haven't sung it too many times, but uh, I really like Up and Down. It's a very upbeat song, but not too upbeat to the point that I have to dance in front of my fans. <laughs> so it's a very good chill vibe, which is what I like. Hmm. I think I would like to collaborate with Sani, uh, he is a Korean rapper and I would love to collaborate with him and working with Hayana was amazing because very unexpected because I didn't know she was able to sing so well and when I heard her I was like you have to feature into this song and it worked out very well. Traveling does but not because I listen to other music but because I feel different feelings when I'm in different countries. For instance, when I was walk touring around uh, Europe, I felt like everything was very romantic in a sense. And there was a lot of, even like the open fields, those were like always so breathtaking. And it kind of made me want to write more of like a romantic song. And I feel like I haven't done too many of those yet. So hopefully I can get one of those songs out there that has been inspired by you guys. One of the most beautiful cities and I really didn't have that much time. I think we only had like half a day to tour the city and I wish we had a couple more days, but I mean, next time. So please do invite me and make sure I come to Paris again so that I can tour the country and eat some of your delicious food. <laughs> yeah.
Yes, I love the French food. I mean, it's kind of hard not to. It's very rich and very decadent, especially your desserts are just perfect. Oh gosh, you guys are making me hungry. <laughs> Ready? Go. Coffee or tea? Coffee. Pop or jazz? Pop. City or countryside? City. Drama series or movie? Ah, movie. Gifts or letters? Ooh. Letters. Uh, Korean songs or US songs? For me, Korean songs. Thank you everyone. Uh, thank you for all your love and support. And thank you K-Pop Times for having me and supporting me. Hopefully, I'll be back in your country to perform for you again. So please give me a lot of love and support. And goodbye. 사랑해요. <laughs>